Did you know that half of the breast cancers occur in women over the age of 65? Only 15% of those women get breast reconstruction. Some studies even show that it is low as 4%. So why are fewer mature women having this type of surgery? It may be due to the perception that there are too many risks in performing breast reconstruction in this older age group. A lot of studies have shown that breast reconstructive surgery today requires two or more operations and all can be done safely in older women. However, there hasn't been much research recently in elderly patients in what's called the direct to implant breast reconstruction which theoretically reduces the number of procedures and post-operative visits in these patients. In a new Hallmark study in the Journal of Plastic and Reconstructive Surgery, a group compared a multiple operation procedure called tissue expander and implant placement reconstruction to this single stage surgery to see if there were any true differences. A group of women who had single step surgery and a group that had multiple step procedures showed similarly low number of complications, including infections and skin loss. But the women who had more of the one and done direct to implant procedures spent fewer days with surgical drains installed, had less readmissions and shorter hospital stays. Makes sense. And also had less post-operative visits. Of course, more research is always welcome in this area, but based upon this study's success rates and low complications, it truly appears that if you're over 65 and you have breast cancer and are interested in breast reconstruction, a single stage direct to implant reconstructive procedure is safe, effective, and truly a great option. If you have any questions about breast reconstruction after cancer, please start your conversation with a board certified plastic surgeon who's a true expert in this area and visit plasticsurgery.org to see if there is one near you. So for the latest science, the latest advances in breast reconstruction and all of plastic surgery, please read free studies every month at prsjournal.com.